Well, hello everybody. I was just lounging around on this sunny day thinking about one of my favorite places, one of my favorite vacations actually, and that was to Sandals Royal Plantation. And I thought I would take a minute to answer a question that a lot of people have. And that question is, what is the difference between a monarch room and a royal monarch room? Those are two of the room categories that are available there. And you'll find that the royal monarch is slightly more expensive than the monarch. And I'm here to tell you why. You see, the big difference between the two, and I'm gonna show you a video I took in the room, is that in the Monarch, you have a double sink, but you have a tub shower combo. So here's the picture actually from the Sandals website of the Monarch room that you can see the double sink and tub shower combo. Now in the Royal Monarch, you have a separate walk-in shower and a big soaking tub in there, but only one sink. So here you can see, this is when we stayed in Royal Monarch room 156, and you saw the single sink out there, a very small counter space, but we love having this walk-in shower and separate tub, as opposed to the tub shower combo. Some people are like, no, I really want both sinks, I need the space, uh, but that's what you're paying for, is that separate shower and tub. Another interesting thing to note is that there are a different number of rooms of each style. So while both of these room categories are overlooking the West Wing, and there are only nine of the Monarch, and there are 18 of the Royal Monarch, the nine of the Monarch are on floors one, two, and three, and the Royal Monarch are spread out between floor zero, I guess, one, two, and three. So there are more of the Royal Monarch available. So now you know the difference between the two. I hope that helped and be sure to like and subscribe. Have a wonderful and marvelous day.